Hey, what's up everyone? Radiant here, and uh, we're about to jump into another popper game. Uh, this time with Simic Threshold, so a green blue deck that's going to be playing uh, creatures that have Threshold, like the uh, Nimble Mongoose. So starting off here, uh, we got a little too many lands. Um, we don't have anything to really start off with. So uh, let's try Mulligan. Alright, this is a little bit better just because we have the Delver of Secrets. We'll keep. Uh, if you're interested in the deck, I will provide a link to Popper Fox's channel. That's where I got the deck from uh, in the description below. So we get to scry a counter spell. We'll actually put that on top of our library so that we can transform Delver Secrets, hopefully. Oh, we're gonna go second, though. Okay, would have been nice if, if it, we were first. Then our next turn we could transform him. an island we'll attack for one and we'll just save our mana to uh, counter something that he's gonna play flying zero two a defender um, it's an artifact. I think that's okay, because we can kill it, unless he pumps it up. If he tries to do a pump spell, we will counter it. Okay, he's going to Rancor it, so let's, uh, I guess that goes back to his hand now. Okay, that that's even better, because now he doesn't have that, but he has two defenders. Okay, we get to transform now. So he can block both of those guys. He can use both those guys to block my guy, but then they'll both die. So uh, we will do. We will attack. And I will ponder just to check out what's going on. I should have played that Delver of Secrets maybe, but I just want to have enough mana to counter something if he has something that needs to be countered. Let's see, Fist of Ironwood. Okay. I guess that's fine. Two other guys. with the three two he's definitely got some kind of pump spell coming because these guys have no attack and then he's got two one ones probably attack with two one ones So nimble mongoose. We'll just go ahead and play one of these. Drop uh, evolving wilds and just attack for three in the air. It's down to eleven. Huh. 
Huh. So do I want to let him have this? I don't think it's that bad, but he does get a free card, but we'll just counter if it's too good. He's only got a 1-1, one, one, so... It's a rancor, a rancor. We'll just uh <laughs> counter that. It goes to the graveyard. Awesome. Let's uh, crack our evolving wilds open and grab ourselves a forest. And we really need uh something to give us some more cards. Oh, I grabbed an island instead of a forest. Okay. We're out of counter spells too, so we're gonna have to really lay on the damage here if we're gonna win. So he's gonna have more pump spells coming out. Another nimble mongoose, so we can't transform him again. Got him at eight. Hmm. We need something to give us some power. We need to create, uh, we need to not let off this threshold ability to win. So, contingency plan. I wish I knew what that did. Okay. So we're gonna play the contingency plan. So we get to look at the top five cards and we can put any number of them into the uh, into the graveyard. We could use this draw card, but it's three mana. Look at the top three cards of your library. Put one of them into your hand and the rest onto the bottom of your library. That's not too bad, anticipate. Let's trash these two evolving wilds. I kind of want to keep the werebear, but I don't think we need it at this point. Um, let's throw the grace in there. So we, we just need seven or more cards in our graveyard. It doesn't have to be of different names. I think we could keep these two. We have uh, six, seven in our graveyard. We should be uh, good to go then. Yeah, so look how look how pumped up we are right now. Uh, three on both these nimble mongooses, and um, we'll go ahead and play another nimble mongoose, and then we're we're gonna attack with everything. So that's gonna be pretty heavy damage. He has to block or die. Okay, W's baby. All right, I think that strategy worked fine. Um, we could maybe th take out uh, this Uona's Grace and put in the uh, Stormbound, no, not the Stormbound guys, the uh, Naturalize, just in case we don't have that situation with the Rancors. Those Rancors could definitely get us. Maybe take out one divination and put in a naturalize. All right, let's go with that. Let's see if we can't pull this W on the match. All 
right, one island. I guess we'll go with one island. Um, we'll play Delver Secrets. I'm only going to keep this hand just because one island plus Delver Secrets could could possibly win the game just by itself. And then we have a Dispel, counter target instant spell. Uh, he might not play an instant, so we'll just go with it, try it out. And we got a forest, nice. So let's play uh, Delver Secrets first. This uh, is almost the same play as last time. counter spell so yes we'll transform uh, drop our forest and since we can't use this uh, counter spell because it's two blue mana we'll go ahead and just drop the nimble mongoose and then we can contingency plan and start getting those cards into our graveyard But I do want to get another island because we need to counter some of those spells that he's got. Okay, that's fine. Alright, I'm actually not going to do anything just because we have a counter spell in our hand that we can use. Just attack for three. I'm not going to attack with the Nimble Mongoose just because we're going to wait for him to get buffed. So let's go ahead and counter that spell. Cuz that doesn't that gives him t plus 2 plus 2, it gives him trample and it gives him life uh life steal. So, uh, no. Put that in your graveyard. We'll let him get in for one. He's tapped out too. Okay, now we can finally get our other spell, but we're gonna have to give up a uh, a turn to let him actually drop something, which is kind of a bummer. Um, let's go ahead and brainstorm. See if we can't get another threshold guy. Wait, where? Oh, okay. Um, so draw three cards, then put two cards from your hand to the top of your library in any order. Um, I like both of those, so let's put on top uh, this dispel this because we don't need that, and we'll do uh, ponder as well, and we'll attack for three. And then let's go ahead and get this so we don't forget on our opponent's turn. So the next turn, not this next turn that he has, but the following turn of his, we can counter. So let's just hope there's nothing dangerous coming out right now. Okay, that's a zero cost guy. That's pretty impressive. So four mana. Okay, he's got a 2-2 two -two flyer. So that's going to... Um 
Whew. That's gonna hurt our Delver. I really needed to counter that spell. Um, but that's okay because we can uh, pump up our Mongoose and possibly just go in with that. Unless he double blocks both of them. And we'll be ready for counter spell. Oh, uh, we cannot do that because we won't be able to counter on the next turn. He's got us, boys. We could make him just, we could just attack, we'll just give up our Delver's secrets so that we can threshold on our next turn and maybe get through for more. I think that's the best plan. Rather than hold off and let him build. Okay, interesting, so he didn't kill our guy. He just blocked it. I guess he didn't want his flyer to die yet at this point. Let's see. Alright, we're gonna um go ahead and just counter that spell right to the graveyard. Uh you're not gonna be doing that. Oh no. Oh no, he got us guys. He got us. Oh man. Well Man, that, that just won him the game right there, that play. Just because he's got the 4-4 now. He knew we were going to do it. I mean, what, what else were we going to do? Let him do it? Uh, and he's going to get 4 life back. It's too much. Okay, he just won the game on that. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, we might have just did something too. So, let's pay 1. Return this guy to his hand, killing the enchantment, I think. Nice. Okay, we're back in it, boys. Just like that, this Simic Threshold deck pays off. All right, let's go ahead and uh, look at the top five and then and Threshold our two guys. Kind of want to keep both these cards because they can be of value. Uh, We'll put the naturalize on top. Well, I guess they go back in any order. Okay. Naturalize on top because I want to have that in case he gets another Rancor or something crazy. So we're ready to go full blast on this guy. We're out of mana, so we're just going to have to make it with whatever he does on the next turn. Which we might be able to. And then we can start countering. Plus we got the naturalize too, so if it isn't if his creature is gonna get that enchantment, um, we're gonna take it away. I mean we've got the win on the board right now. Alright, so he's got this guy again. We can't kill it, but we can get through for six. Okay, we can get through for three and possibly lose our Delver secrets. That's okay, though. Um, if we counter a spell, we can't destroy an enchantment. So, I think we just attack with the two mongooses and just save our flyer. So he has to take six or kill both his guys. Um, I think that's the best plan because I don't want to lose my Delver of Secrets. Okay, he's going to take three. That's fine. So he's got the one guy left. We can counter the spell. He may be prepared for that. So if it's an enchantment, I might just let him play it and then I will destroy it. Artifact or enchantment. Yeah, that card's pretty good. The naturalize is good to have in the sideboard for sure. Let's just get this W. We're down there. Six damage left. 
Okay, here we go. Um, he's got plenty of mana open. And I think that's fine. You know what? Just... Oh no. We didn't want to let that happen. Um, because now he's got two blockers, so he gets another turn. He gets another turn. I wish I could stop that at this point. I don't think we can counter the, the ability. We'd have to counter the card. So we uh, misplayed there. We should have countered that card. 2-1-1 one, one green. Sprawling creatures. Kind of a bummer. He's not going to attack. He's not that dumb. Alright, what can we do here? He'll just block to save his guy. He'll block the two guys. He may even kill one of them. But he'd have to use this too. Um, so let's ponder. Let's take a look and see what we have coming out. We have another Delver of Secrets. Alright, so yeah, we want the Delver of Secrets, I think. Uh, put the cards back in any order. So we'll do that, that, and put this on top. Do not shuffle the library. We'll attack with two mongooses. Make him block, and then we just have to get through the next turn. have to make it oh wow so he's gonna block both those guys impressive is he gonna pump it up we'll, we'll counter if he pumps and then he, he can't counter, counter it Alright, kill one of our mongoose. He's got a 1 1 left with 3 damage. We got him right now, boys. Boys and girls, we got him. Just gotta make sure he doesn't. He could drop two of those flyers for zero cost. Oh, at the end of my turn. Okay, that's fine. He's just gonna get a, a land off that. He discarded that, right? Yeah. He, he Maybe he needs land so that he can counter. Um, that could be a possibility. So he has enough mana to cast what he's trying to cast and then counter, counter it. He might be making uh, some 1-1s. One as long as they're not flying, we're good. We just don't want to see a flyer or kill spell. Or even a counter spell. Alright, he was waiting on me. Alright, let's get him. Three damage left. Just gotta fly over there. The Delver of Secrets and get this guy. Okay, he's gonna snake out. Okay. That's fine. He's got a 1-1. One, one. It's not flying though. You just don't want a flyer to come out. Oh, we need two blue for the counter target spell. Okay, he's going to draw more, I guess. That's fine. It's not flying. Unless he has something crazy he's going to get out in his hand that's going to kill my flyer Like it, when he comes in. He's going to recast the snake and draw another card. Maybe he's looking for it right now. He's looking for something that'll kill a flyer, probably. Or he loses. Or he's looking for a flyer. But he won't have enough mana probably left. How much is this, uh, Mold Drifter? It's five. Yep, there we go! W's, man! The Simic Threshold deck. I, I have to say, this deck has is, is been pretty good. I, I've lost 
one match. I've pl played like five or six matches. And I've only lost one match with it, but uh, glad you guys could see uh, how well this deck works. It's it's pretty awesome. So check out the, the description. Uh, Popper Fox has this deck, uh, and I'll have a link down there for the deck list that he uh, puts on YouTube. And uh, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit that thumbs up button. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this one when they come out. Alright, thanks. Peace.